so here you can see what all those uh, i can say condition i am just giving you an example what all those condition could be so this condition could be like you have seen if you are already working in a production environment if there is already a script which is using by your team right so there you can see like n1 is equal to n2 like this kind of a under if under if statement you can see this kind of conditions will be there either it could be n1 is greater than n2 n1 is greater uh, greater than n2 right n1 is greater than equal to n2 right same like string 1 is equal to string 2 string 1 is not equal to string 2 so like these these are call it we call it as a conditions guys by use of these conditions only you can get the exact output what the output you have desired okay so let me take so let me take you again back here try to understand this one so this we are call it as a test command guys and this test command we are going to put inside your if then statement as a condition okay so uh, under this test command this is divided into three uh, you can say category or type so further it, it could be your numeric comparison, string comparison and file comparison. So in today's session, I am going to show you mostly the new numeric comparison and the string comparison. I know this uh, topic is little bit bigger, but this is how you have to understand guys. Okay. And string comparison is further divided into string equality, string order and string size. So let me take you through each and every uh, type over here uh the conditions you can say it and i can show you with the script also how we can fulfill these conditions guys so let's start with this numeric comparison so under numeric comparison what all conditions can be applied guys so this under numeric comparison the conditions or you can say the comparisons we use as a n1 is equal to n2 check if n1 is equal to n2 right n1 is greater than n2 check if n1 is greater than or equal to n2 n1 is greater than n2 check if n1 is greater than n2 n1 is less than equal to n2 n1 is less than n2 and n1 is not equal to n2 guys okay so let's go to the system and see how we can uh get this condition true or false right okay. don't forget to like share and subscribe the channel and press the bell icon for all the latest notifications